Hi everybody, this is Lisa Washington with Vitality Natural Skin Therapies. And so I want to come to you guys with a true confession. So I have not eaten candy in like decades. I'm not a big candy person, even though I love desserts, but I'm not a super sweet person. But yesterday we went and saw Superman, the Man of Steel. It was an awesome movie. I mean, I love this Superman. Like, And back in the day, my Superman was definitely Christopher Reeve, and I had a crush on him. But I'm so loving the new Superman, and it was incredible. So I, when I go to the movies, I want to have my popcorn, and I love that. I'll do my popcorn. I'm happy with that. But somehow, yesterday, I ended up with my one of my favorite candies as a child is Reese's Pieces. I love Reese's Pieces. So I got a bag, and I was, I'm just going to eat just a little. But I ended up eating like half a bag of Reese's Pieces. So I woke up this morning. Awful headache, body aches like I have the flu, and I'm. If you can tell, I'm still in my bed. But I want to do more of a um, vlog on this about how sugar affects the skin. So here goes. So how sugar affects the skin is that it actually produces what's called glycation, and glycation is when sugar attaches itself, when sugar gets in your bloodstream and it attaches itself to proteins, it actually causes these new molecules to develop, which is called advanced glycation in products. In short, it's called ages. And the more sugar you eat, the more ages are produced. And so what, what is ages? What does it do? What ages does? It goes in and it damages and attacks collagen and elastin in our bodies. Collagen is a protein fiber and it's one, the most I mean, one of the most important protein fibers that's in our bodies, but on a skincare level, is that what collagen does, it helps our skin to stay firm and elastic. And when ages goes in there and it damages it because of all the sugar we're eating, it breaks that collagen down and becomes dry and brittle, which in turn produces wrinkles and sagging skin. Now, this process can show up at early as, you know, 35, but right after that age of 35 years old, that process is a lot faster. So consuming more and more sugar, you're just speeding up the aging process. Now, sugar also, how I'm feeling this morning, it actually breaks down the immune system. It helps us to not be able to fight off bacteria and infections. So this is why I have this headache and I have all this body ache going on like I have the flu because I'm not a big sugar eater. So I like to call sugar, like Reese's Pieces, the sweet bully because it's so sweet, but it kind of does a bulliness on our bodies. But here's some things that you can do. I like to call these my beautiful energy foods. So what I'm doing today, I, I feel a lot better than I did earlier today, drinking plenty of clean water, juicing um, fruits and vegetables that are high in vitamin C and carotin. So juicing cucumbers with my celery and my apples and a lot of leafy greens. And within the end of the day, most of the time when I have moments like this, I'm completely fine. But incorporating more of those foods in your diet, incorporating more fruits and vegetables, high vitamin C and vitamin E foods into your diet actually helps offset when we're having those issues um, with sugar. Another thing you can do to help boost collagen, because it's never too late to boost the collagen in your body, is using products that are rich in vitamin C and vitamin C ester, but also using um, one particular product we have here at B-Tally is B3, which is niacin. B3 has been scientifically tested to help boost collagen back in the skin. So that's my little education for the day. Uh, Y'all pray for us to send this headache that it goes away. I'm going to keep drinking all my water and juicing today. And um, I probably won't see Reese's Cups again or Reese's Pieces for a really, really, really long time, if ever. But remember to always live well and live beautifully. Talk to you later. Bye.